leads us into the Georgia Southern Eagles. Now, Chad Lunsford uh, had this team rolling for a little bit, and and now maybe not so much. Win total here sits at four and a half. Over is minus 125. The under is minus 105. This is a true triple option team. Sure. That's what they do. Uh, their FP Plus projected record is five and seven, along with uh, FPI. So both the exact same thing. They went eight and five last year, seven and six the year before that. They're returning production, number 113 in the country. Yeah. Everybody else is returning basically everybody. They're returning basically nobody. I say nobody. That 62% is not bad. Uh, but their schedule, man. You think that's tough for a triple option team? That's I, that's a, the kind of ball you want experience in? Yeah, I think so. A little think bit. It matters? Um, I think I think the issue right now is that they've only got one. So they don't have a, a real starter at quarterback. Um, the offensive line and three running backs return, so that's good. But if you don't get the the signal caller right at quarterback, they could run into major league issues, right? That's right. It's about uh, athleticism, and it's about reading yeah. the defense and getting the read right. Yes. Uh, their defense, by the way, uh, has been great, but they are losing their three most disruptive players. There is, uh, there's hope with some exciting new players, but the issue right now is the schedule is just brutal. Yep. They, uh, they drew Louisiana cross division. They play Arkansas and BYU in, uh, in non-con. Um, to get to their fourth straight bowl is going to be really difficult yeah, to do. Yeah, I was do. just about to say, getting six wins. Yes. I mean, this is, come easy. this is really difficult looking at the schedule. At Troy, uh, at Texas State, at App State, BYU is on the schedule, like I said. Uh, Georgia State at home. Like, it, this is this is rough. This is rough to do, man. And, and they play the kind of ball that can keep you in games. Sure. But, I mean... One explosive play here or there, and, and they could be in some serious it trouble. It breaks their back. If they yeah. get down by two scores, it makes it really hard to come back from that. Yes. Because they don't – while their defense isn't bad, they don't get a lot of takeaways. No, you're you're 100% right about that. Um, I'm going to go under. Yeah, what's under the, the juice the half, under again? Uh, minus 105. Yeah, I'd go under. Go yeah, under minus 105. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.